This is Earth Radio. And now here's human music. Was it really necessary? I think it is necessary because if you need it, then other people might need it. So, uh, yeah, just, but like the lights, I mean, it's cameras. Cool. Well, it's just like maybe doing an Instagram story. Hey, look, NVMe drives working a Mac Pro, but you might as well just do it properly. All right, okay, guess. So, what do you want to talk about? The answer's not out there on the internet, so give the answer. So, what was your problem? And what's the solution? Just My problem was that I couldn't afford an iMac Pro. No, it's probably best not to say that. Well, they're too expensive. How about... Unless they want to sponsor us, I mean... The basics of it is that it's a good computer. Yeah. So why throw it away to get the latest one when you can just update your one? All right, yeah. Well, you've said it now, so... No, you... Off. Right, so the problem is I couldn't afford an iMac Pro. I mean, that's the same thing again. But it's true. I really wanted a new computer that was really fast. And Pete, who's like, oh, I can't afford that, don't spend the money. So here we are, having to build stuff. But it's fun. And the computer you've got is a good computer. The problem I was having, as a lot of people are having, is they want the new PCIe SSD cards with stupidly fast read and write speeds, like 1400 meg a second. What are you getting now? The boot drive is like 300 and on my other drives, the normal mechanical drives, like 150 meg, it's usable, but it's extremely slow for um, video editing. So pulling off of large video files, it can't pull it off that quickly. So I know there's loads of people that have that problem. I was clearly one of them. And upgrading to an iMac Pro at the moment, it seems a little bit like a trap, especially when there's a new Mac Pro coming out at the end of this year. Um, and also it's seven grand plus for something that you can't um, take apart. Just skip to the end. NVMe SSD drives that go on your PCA slots, your Mac Pro. That doesn't sound that exciting. If it was a radio commercial, right? like give it your best radio voice. Okay. What have you got there? I have from Samsung, the new NVMe 960 Evo M.2 SSD drives. Now I'm excited. Yeah, these are exciting. Well, they're not, they're kind of like tiny and they just go in your computer, but they make a fast hard drive. One of these. Um, this is a 250 gig, and because it's just for a scratch drive, uh, as in just to work off, that's plenty. A couple hundred quid, and I'll get it up to blistering fast speeds, probably faster than the iMac Pro's read and write speeds. Uh, you're probably gonna have to put like a... Disclaimer, maybe. Possibly. Possibly, but I am fitting it so it could break as well. There is that. I could just break my computer. So, I mean, you must have bought the best one out, surely. I got the best one I could afford. It's Christmas and stuff, you know. I've just got a new car. But now you seem like a cheapskate. I got the best one if this was the only one available. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to use that to why that brand and that particular one. I saw some other guys putting it in their Max and it seemed like it worked. Oh, that's actually true though. Um, High Sierra, the new operating system 10.13, works with these NVMe SSD drives. So the operating system recognizes them by default, which means these ones work. And all you need is one of them, a couple hundred quid, 20, 30 quid, a PCIe board for it, put it in, stick it in your computer, done. And this is just the, the PCIe right, board for it. A minute. a minute ago, I just needed to spend 200 quid. Now there's something else I need. You need a screwdriver too. Right, if you, I mean, for goodness sake. So if you haven't got a screwdriver, buy one. You need, um, we call them Phillips or Posi drives. You want the hard drive itself and then the PCIe card to go on it. I bought the Lycom D120 from Amazon. I'll put a link below, it's dirt cheap. I think it was like 20 or 30 quid, maybe, maybe even less, it might have been 15. Right. I should you, know that. You're just guessing at prices. <sighs> I mean, it could be one of those, just, it's, it's on the screen. Put, put your right hand up in the air, like down a bit more. Right, just there, that's the price. I think it might actually be 15 quid, now I remember. But anyway, 
Link below. It's super easy to install because it's PCIe, so it literally just slots into the computer. Mac Pros, the 5.1s, the 4.1s and the 3.1s um, were designed to be easy to upgrade, so it's pretty sweet that these new hard drives work with them, and we should get 2018 speeds in a 2009 computer. Let's do it. Do we cut now? That's important. I meant to do that. Right, that's actually really boring. Well, it's computer stuff. It's not going to be really exciting, is it? Well, it could be. Have you seen how to basics? All you need is some eggs. Don't get the eggs. I'm not Googling the answer if that's what you're thinking. Shall I leave this bit in? No, definitely don't, no. We need this to be like a tutorial. Got it working. I mean, I already know how to do it. Do this, add more life to your Mac, be happy, faster disk speeds, sweet. And don't buy an iMac Pro. Save yourself seven grand, spend a couple hundred quid. Do you think Samsung will sponsor this? Uh, probably not. They might. Look. You'll probably get about 20p for that. Mate, that's 20p off. I mean, I'll, I'll put it to Samsung, see what they think. Maybe um, Casey could help us. Casey, if you watch this... He, he probably won't. He liked a tweet I did once. He liked one tweet and you didn't stop <coughs> going on about it. So Casey, when you watch this... I mean, you could put Casey's face over your <coughs> face and use that as the thumbnail. Uh, yeah, or anyone at Samsung. Good job on your NVMe SSD 960 Evo M.2 drive. Good job. That, I mean, maybe come up with a catchier name because you can't really say it in a rush. Um, good job. Give us some money. Maybe buy another one. I mean, can you give us an ending for this video? If you liked it, you know, uh, or people uh, do that sort of thing, like, oh, press the button, subscribe and all that. Yeah, but I genuinely don't really care. If you watched it till the end, well done because that was hard work. It was hard work filming it. And, you know, cheers. There's buttons, press them, or just wait for the next video, which is probably gonna be someone good like Marcus Brownlee, Unbox Therapy, uh, or Stone Mountain. Yeah, watch that. That's how you waste every evening. I love it, just watching play PUBG. So yeah, that's the ending to the video. Um, bye. Can we do a thumbnail? You oh my god! Yeah, one of those I'll use. Don't use that one.